So Bill, what do we have here? This is a mixture of a deep water culture system and an aeroponic system. Within here is a manifold. There's eight jets on the manifold, four on the top, four on the bottom. Your grow medium sits in this container here, and the roots hang out of the bottom of the basket. And inside of the container housed an air stone, and there's probably about four or five inches of water that sits in the bottom that's constantly being oxygenated, and then a pump constantly sprays through these jets. So it's a mixture of two hydroponic systems. And I use flexible PVC so that the system has some somewhat of flexibility. It's a little bit more expensive than the rigid stuff, but it's higher quality in my opinion. And uh, you know, if you need to move your buckets a couple inches because your plants are getting too wide or whatever, you can do it. It's pretty easy. And uh, the couplers make for a quick build of the system. You can get this thing together in less than five minutes. Fill it up. and start mixing your nutrients immediately. This container, this is your reservoir. It has a screw off lid for ease. I mean, we've, we all know how much of a pain in the ass it is to take off a five gallon bucket lid. That was not a pain in the ass at all. Your 400 gallon per hour pump is contained in here and it will spray through both of these manifolds. And this is a, this is a closet system for you know, a medical patient or a hobbyist. And you can sit on this while you work on your plants. Extremely sturdy. Everything's contained within your closet. As they get bigger, you don't have to mess with the net pots at all. The separate reservoir makes for easy mix mixture of nutrients and checking your pH and that kind of stuff. So that's the system. Beautiful. And they go for 200 bucks with pumps. Fully self-contained and your uh, growing medium. Ready to go. You can't beat it. We're ready to go. Yep. You can't beat it, definitely. Mount Shasta. You'll see all that green stuff in there. You don't want that. By using uh, magic mineral, it absorbs all that unnecessary water from the ground. Without magic mineral? Yeah. Without With magic mineral, there is much less. And this magic mineral eventually is going to get, get rid of all the green stuff from there. There, that green stuff, but in here, there is much, much more. And this green buildup in here is not happening because this can eventually turn into mold. And mold, you don't want it mold, you know. You don't want to be smoking. Exactly. Magic mineral. Get some.